I'm J.D. Durkin reporting from the floor of the New York Stock Exchange. Markets saw a nice pop during intraday trading Thursday as the tech sector led stocks higher for the day. Shares of Amazon, Microsoft and Meta all saw gains. Investors are continuing to react to comments from Fed Chair Jerome Powell that the U.S. Central Bank would likely cut interest rates three times between now and the end of 2024. Markets are now pricing in a 70 percent chance of an interest rate cut as soon as June. In other news, companies across the United States will likely see productivity plummet over the next few weeks, and they have only one thing to blame. March madness, of course. According to WalletHub, corporate losses are expected to total more than $17 billion due to unproductive workers during the NCAA tournament. The average worker will spend seven hours watching college hoops during its duration, with 26% of Americans saying they're prepared to skip work altogether in order to watch. And if employers want to keep workers happy while they are working, they should lean into the madness. 78% of employees said celebrating the tournament while at work helps to boost morale, and 39% said they became closer with a coworker after participating in an office pool. However, if you think you could show off to your team by picking the perfect brackets, you won't. The odds of making every correct selection are 1 in 9.2 quintillion. To put that into a bit of perspective, you have better odds of winning back-to-back -back lotteries buying just a single ticket for each drawing. That'll do it for your daily briefing. From the floor of the New York Stock Exchange, I'm J.D. Durkin with The Street.